What is happening everybody? My name is the Psycho Chemist and today we got a special video for you guys. Now currently I am still editing the video that um I'm originally doing for the second episode of uh the Warrior's Journey. And that is still a work in progress. You see, I'm editing it very strategically and as I'm doing this, I'm gonna keep thinking about you guys because I want to see all the feedback from you so hopefully I do because the last video did great and I really appreciate all the support um, if you do want to support this video and the late video that is going to be coming out tonight uh, make sure to leave a like also uh, hit that subscribe button if you are new to the channel um, I'm going to be doing less Fortnite videos because I don't want you guys to get upset with me too much because a lot of you still hate Fortnite after what happened so uh, yeah things have been uh, a little unexpected but yeah just give me a few chances to just get through everything and then we'll talk about everything else but other than that um, I, let's just get into some of the things I want to talk about number one school um, I didn't have enough time to get through update uh, but I do want to say this things are not going to be easy when it comes to uploading I'll explain that uh, for another time, but uploading will not be easy for me during school because uh, I'm probably going to get a job because I was thinking about actually working around GameStop and it's going to be interesting to see how I actually do and that depends on what's going to be happening. So yeah, be in support of that by the way. Um, one more thing after that, I just want to mention the other few videos that's going to be coming out which is XCOM. Um, that's going to be up um, on later terms because I don't want um, to have only uh, App Solver to have as a series because I don't want that to be there and to be honest I'd rather not have a Fortnite as my daily upload video because to be honest with you um, daily uploading these is very difficult as it is and I can't really like win a game so yeah it's going to be a lot more difficult for me, and to be honest with you, I'd rather not stick to 50 v 50 because everybody keeps doing it, and uh, most importantly, everybody says it, so, absolutely shit, but other than that, um, I'll just still do it anyway because um, I'm still doing my challenges, um, I'm not going to be streaming them because obviously my Wi-Fi is still acting up, and since my cousin moved in, things are going to be a little bit difficult for me to actually just do like things there because he's going to be using the internet, and both of me and I are going to have a problem with the internet, so it's going to be difficult. So, just please, I had to let you guys know, just because of that situation. But other than that, let's just focus on a few things uh, while we're at it. And that is, number one, a couple things that I'm going to be having. If we reach at least five likes on this video I will I will talk about this topic and this topic is none other than race related uh, so XCOM is going to be a little bit different from any other game that I've ever played uh, keep in mind XCOM is actually a little bit different than anything else so I would love to get back to it and it's going to be like one of the best games I've ever actually played because to be honest with you I've actually played it around as a kid and it was awesome and I just love the game to death so I'm just going to play or oh, was it so calm no it was so calm never mind it was so calm so I never played this game before <laughs> but uh, without further ado let's just uh, put a few things aside um, and talk about um, daily events that's been happening on YouTube now first of all I wanted to clear things up as ways you guys would understand I'm an open-minded person and for me to legitimately do something as just go out um, and judge people that's not my thing but when it comes to my friends obviously I have to be honest with them and throughout the time I had to legitimately speak to them on one-on-one um, -on -one terms it was when we had this discuss about Frank Lampard but we're not gonna go there other than that I want to actually clear a few things with you guys number one 
the fact that I haven't gotten through a ton of things in life, it hasn't been easy for me. The only reason I've been having problems like getting through things in life was only because I can't seem to outstand the gate. And that gate specifically is the gate that I've entered once before and I haven't entered for years. It's been a while since I've, like, gotten through all this stuff, and to be honest with you, it wasn't as easy as you think it is. The more I realize the fact that I've been put through the task of just humiliating myself, I've realized the fact that there has been a ton of issues lately, and things are not as easy as you think it is. Sometimes I just stick to what I deal with and what I have to deal with, and sometimes that's just how it is. But, within this case of the events, I want to clear up the air. Number one, I don't choose KSI nor Logan Paul. Because both of them are pretty much in the wrong. And to be honest with you, it's just... <sighs> to be honest, it just makes me sad. Because, number one... I'm willing to just mind my own business and leave this alone. But the fact, the fact that, first of all, KSI hasn't changed his maturity. Because number one, I'm willing to forget all that and just choose. But then again, it, in my mind, it still goes up and up and it keeps on snapping onto my brain. And I'm like... What are these guys doing? It just doesn't make any sense. I'm willing to bring myself and come clean to what I'm about to say right now. I don't hate the guys at all for this fight. I definitely don't hate them for what they're about to do. But I do not go against them or I do not vote for them. Because to be honest with you, voting for them is is like freaking voting for Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump. That is one of the worst because number one KSI has proven proven to be a simple person right that number one is very immature for his age and number two willing to step up to the factor that he is wrong for what he says but doesn't go with it now here's the reason I have my certain problems with this if you look at any other and keep in mind I agree with I agree with some things that Logan Paul has said, said. not all of it just some I agree with one thing that you cannot bring anything personal onto a table in a press conference that's just something you don't do like if you see any other boxing match or anything like that you just don't bring the, that type of stuff up you just don't now Obviously, Logan Paul was wrong for that because obviously he did that in the same press conference in America. Which, of course, he was only doing that to entertain. The same with Jake Paul. There was nothing different. So, obviously, adults were being a little bit immature, but also was just being entertaining just for YouTube and, most importantly, just for their fans. That's it. Now, KSI may have taken that a little too far now. Testicle joke was a little, a little unnecessary, but Logan Paul did the same thing. Talking about his girl, though? That was just a bit too far there. You kind of took it to a point where you kind of just made it worse. Sure, talk about his family. Talk about his father. Talk about his brother. When did it, the girl come in? I understand the rest of the family going through. I didn't know you was going to bring the girl into this. When have he ever talked about your girl, KSI? When has he ever talked about your girl, man? Please explain. Right, because he never actually talked about it. Because she never got involved. Precisely what I mean. So why would you bring that, bring that up in a press conference? That doesn't make any sense, man. Wake the fuck up. Like, keep in mind, I don't stick with Logan Paul at all. Because, again, he still has made mistakes. Because I, so is you. Don't say you haven't made any mistakes. Period. So, that's all I gotta say, bro. But one more thing I have to say, keep it to yourself. And just don't allow that certain stuff to get to you. Like, sure. Have a good ego, but dude, don't have certain hate for somebody to that extent. That's not how boxing works, man. I'm just saying. And just because he clickbaited you does not mean you legitimately have to go 
against Logan. You should have just went against Jake. That would have been a better option, but no. I also think that he's still wrong for this, so I'm still not voting. Actually, on second thought, I'm just not going to get involved in all. What am I saying? I'll take that back. I'm not getting involved at all. I'm leaving it. I'm leaving it. Anyway, so let's work on about a few things that I have to basically cover up.